Welcome to the Dog Pass Show. Today we have a guest from one of my favorite nonprofits, and that's Forgotten Friends. They're right here in Austin, Texas, and they support the rescue and adoption of mixed breed dogs. My name is Lauren Bogatz. I'm a head volunteer coordinator for Forgotten Friends Mixed Breed Rescue. A lot of them tend to have much better health. They lit tend to live longer. The reason for that is when you have a specific breed, they're being bred for specific traits. Sometimes they tend to have just genetic disorders. So that's just from breeding them over and over again. With mixed breeds, you don't have as many issues with health and specific disorders. A mixed breed can provide many different types of personality traits. They get the best of both worlds if you find what you're looking for. This is an opinion, but I tend to, they just tend to be really loving and open arms with their owners. I got a ch- Chihuahua Papillon Mountain Dog. That's one. So, really? <laughs> yeah, she's a she's an oddball, itty bitty. At foster home, they're able to see their personality, see how they act around other dogs, around children, right? So we have an idea of what that's looking like, and we put that information. We're very up front and we you know have that conversation we're making the right fit so then uh, when things do get back to somewhat back to normal then these families are still feeling good about their decision with the adoption i think that's such an excellent point and it's something i've been hearing a lot lauren which is when things normalize a bit right what happens to this huge influx of dogs that have been adopted and purchased maybe it's concerns over nothing and it will all be all good and people had time to integrate the dog into their house or maybe it's going to be a crisis so we're going to have to keep an eye on that definitely crossing my fingers sykes is two-year-old blonde terrier mix 15 pounds and then we've got oscar (laughs) meyer and he's really cute they're all cute but He's a two-year-old dachshund. We've also got Radish. He's a little bit older. He's an eight-year-old chihuahua. Well, hopefully by the time this episode airs, uh, they're adopted. But if not, we'll definitely be highlighting and showing them. Um, You know what? We'll show them anyways. (laughs) We'll just put an adopted note. Yeah. (laughs) You are saving a life. They could be euthanized. You know, if we don't take action and save some of these dogs, because these are local shelters in Austin. Some of them are a little further out, but saving these dogs is so important and they bring so much joy. I want to thank Lauren and the entire team at Forgotten Friends for all the amazing work they've been doing over the years. And thank you for watching. We will catch you on the next episode.